welcome to today's video. Just check in on my girls. They're all out there, happy as can be, having breakfast. Uh, embargo, embargo, Gabby. We're doing our spelling test right now. We're doing today's a testing day. We have a bunch of tests here uh, that we're doing. This is what school looks like on the day by day fire. Minimize. What's uh, mine? Gl glass. So after our spelling test, they both just got one wrong. They both just got one wrong. Um, we are moving on to a math test, and then we're going to do uh, uh, another test. All right, so school is done, cleaning is done, laundry is done. Only thing left to do at home today is go out and take the girls off the grass. Gracie lays down for her. She loves to sunbathe, you guys. She's always done this. She's laying down to sunbathe, but then she'll eat. Oh, she's just sleeping. Oh, look at how cute. And the other girls can tell time. They're like, you're late to take us in. Like, that's how much they like to get off the grass. Once the sun gets to a certain temperature, they're like, oh, I want in the shade, and then they spend the whole entire day in the arena. That's in my glasses, Paul. Let's you like it? Penny's like, where's my girl? You like it? Yeah. <laughs> See, my, I can tell she's feeling better because she'd be walking fast. Just one, just one. What do you think? You like it too? She sent those to you for free. She just included them in our order. Wasn't that kind? Penny literally uh, shoves her face in the halter. She's like, and Willow too. Like they all, like you guys, it's shocking when you have your horses at home, the things that you learn about them. Like, <laughs> she's like, wait, I need one more bite. <laughs> all right, come on, let's go. Um, and like they don't enjoy being hot in the sun and the shelter is nice and they all go in it except for Gracie because they don't let her. <laughs> but they love the arena. They love their arena and I'm so grateful to have it. Let's go. You guys hear Penny walking? Listening to your horse walk on cement can tell you so much about their health. Watch, now she'll take it off. Wait, wait, be kind. <laughs> She's, she gets anxious about getting it. Hey, be kind. <laughs> Normally she's not that bad. It's true though. Gabby, you got a brush. It's so true though. Like, hey. if your horse has an injury in its leg somewhere. I mean, I don't know the complete specifics of everything and I don't know how to exactly say it perfectly. But if your horse is like struggling to move a certain way or they're like, hey, they've changed their gait a certain way, you can hear it when they walk on cement or on the road. Like you can hear, you should hear, be able to hear like a very specific sound that is the normal for them. And when your horse has an injury or you think your horse isn't moving properly, you can hear it on cement and it's super cool. And I just want to say that I was just noticing that my girl Penny was sounding better than she has sounded in a long time. So, yay. All right, it is grooming time. She got most of her hair off just by like rolling. Yeah, you need to spray her mane too and brush that. You got to brush your horse first. Yeah, okay. I want you to brush her, all her body. And her legs. I sat here the other night and I pulled out all this hair. You know how like this well, hair? I was just pulling it out. See this stuff that just comes out like in big yes, clumps? I like pulling that out. I know, I love pulling it out too. Like it just, just comes out and she likes it too.
even groom our horses while they just stand here is so like fascinating to me. Like I know you guys have seen us do that before, but for the most part, the fact that our horses just stand here and be with us and we groom them and pick their feet and do everything and we don't use a single thing to tie them or make them stay, like is amazing to me. And maybe it really doesn't mean that much. <laughs> I don't know, but it means a lot to me because we had to work with our horses and, and train them and like Crazy. get them to understand that that's what we wanted and it was fun. Unfortunately, we can't, two of us can't work with our horses with one wa wandering around. The annoying one, <laughs> the bratty one. The one that does not listen no matter what you say. Look how pretty your hair is, Gracie. Yeah. Man, I love her. So I was saying yesterday that I need to like make a video all about Gracie because you guys don't know how great she is. She's like, she's like Finn. She's our second Finn. She's talented and has drive like Finn and wants to do things like Finn and is excited to do things like Finn and can do things like Finn. Um, just Finn runs away from us. And she is so friendly to everybody. Like, we've had people come into our yard, come into our barn that she doesn't know, and the other horses are like way out there. They're like, oh, stranger danger. And Gracie's like, I'm coming. I see you all. found Willow spot see I found her spot yeah, I've already every time I scratch her there I think she has a bug bite I've already scratched her there before. she she grooms me and it feels so good until she bites you so that's what I was trying to show you guys that's from her heat and I keep trying to like brush it off and clean it off I actually have to go get a hose and and water and spray her and clean it off like that's how a awful water? I need to go get like a bucket and water and some soap and really clean it off like and I have to put Vaseline all down her butt so that that stuff doesn't like all that pee and stuff doesn't burn her skin I think one thing with Penny is that for probably a lot of her life she was a horse I feel like I know I feel yeah she used to poop right on the wall I feel like, like she is a horse. So I feel like in part of her, in a large part of her life, she probably was treated like a horse and not like a play toy, not like a pet. Look at her swishing her tail at you. Oh. See, she likes you. She thinks you don't like her. And that's the way it is in the world a lot, you guys. Lots of times when you go out there and you have problems with people, lots of times it's because of misunderstandings and miscommunication. Sometimes they think you don't like them and sometimes you think they don't like you and then all of a sudden you both think you don't like each other and all it takes is just a few minutes of kindness to reset the whole balance. Because look at my girl be loving you, Sophie. So Sophie's going to do something. She's going to see, see what our horses do when we just run up to them. Okay, go. Gracie just stands there. Kitty Willow. She, she's investigating. Will is like, nope, not on my life. Don't make a run. Penny's like, no way. 
There is none of that in my, in my life. <laughs> She's coming to me. She's like, oh my goodness. Did you see what she just tried to do to me? How rude. I belong to you, Laura. <laughs> <gasps> it's okay, Ben. She just wanted to love you. you. It's important that you love everybody, Penny. It's important that you love all the people in this family, not just me. Okay? Can you do that? Remember me? The one who tried to give you a hug. There you go. <laughs> Be kind. Look at Willow grooming Ruby. Did you guys see that? Willow's grooming Ruby. It's officially happened, you guys. I was not expecting it. It's officially happened. Gabby and I are the first ones in the car. I always make jokes about it because we always are always waiting for Gabby. But you guys should know that Gabby takes her time, does everything precisely, and rarely makes mistakes. And that is the benefit of being slow. I hurry, get things done, and sometimes it's not pretty. But, so I appreciate it. I appreciate that Gabby is always slow, and Sam's like Gabby too. Sophie's the last one. I got a seat in my seat. You're the last one. Why do you need money? Why do you need money? Buying everybody coffee. You're buying everybody coffee? <laughs> too expensive. They're all there? Tina's there. They're all there? They knew you were coming. Girls are going to get the horses and they're all here. Look at those boys be loving each other. And Stormy's over there too. They came down to get a drink probably because it's hot. I told Sam, watch, by the time the girls get out there, they'll be gone. Oh no, look, he's coming. Hi, Finn. Storm. Come here, Stormy. Oh, they waited. Aw, see you guys. You guys worried about us and we did it. Our horses are better now. trying to figure out Storm's feet so that his back doesn't get sore. He just freshly had Cairo and he just freshly got new feet so his back should be fine. But we are has, still haven't like he we know that he need like we know that he needs a certain kind of pad on his feet. Our farrier doesn't carry them. Um, so we're trying to figure out something else. So right now he doesn't have any pad on his feet and I know that that's not going to work for him because it's never worked for him before. So we are like so Gabby's just gonna ride him, flat him, quick, see how he's doing, and then she's gonna ride Chino. Like Storm is not lame. Storm is not in bad shape. Storm is not anything that a lot of people are saying that he is. He still needs to be ridden while we figure this stuff out. He still needs to be kept active for his health. He still needs to be, yeah, like. Oh, you like that, huh? Yeah, holy. Smell how fruity they smell. Mm, okay, Stormy. Sour good. keys. It's for you, because we love you. He's like, you don't love me that much, because that's not what I like. Okay, let's try Gino. You got my over here. Uh-oh, what happened to his neck? Oh, he was rolling in poo. And he likes it too. So there are going to be days where Gabby's like waiting until we figure out Storm's feet where she rides him lightly in the arena and she just flats him and you might not see that all the time. You might think that she's not riding him at all, but she definitely is still riding him, still keeping him going. I hope that makes sense. I don't know how else to say it. Gabby be moving fast today. Holy heck. Why are you wearing a mask? Because of the sand? What? I do not know what she just said, but she's wearing a mask. This girl, this girl, you guys don't understand. She's so serious. Like, she always listens to every rule. She's just like her dad. Like, she doesn't do things that are wrong. 
So you guys see that she's riding him on a loose rein and his head is up in the air right now. It's It's because he is not warmed up and we don't ever uh, ride our horses in a frame until they get warmed up because it can be damaging to our horse's back. And that's what we've been trained, it might be different. Other people might think different things, but that's why we ride them for a long time without being in a frame. We only ride in a frame after they're warmed up and my kids do like massively long warm ups because that's what our trainer wants them to do. How does he feel with those new feet? Feels the same. Feels the same. I'm trying to let go of this heartache. It's been following me around. It wakes me up. It shoots me down. At this 